On October 23, 1962, and at the age of 80, Frances Perkins, political confidant of President Franklin D. Roosevelt, and first woman cabinet member, spoke to the headquarters employees of the Social Security Administration at a general staff meeting. <laughs> army went through and it was in a blaze of glory and Harrison was congratulated and, and, uh, and uh, Doughton was congratulated and they all beamed and, and uh, I gave a party. And, uh, <laughs> uh, but uh, it was a perfectly simple party but it was one of great rejoicing uh, which we all felt was justified uh, and then of course began the great problem which you have taken over, the administration of this act because thousands and thousands of problems arose in the administration which had not been foreseen by those who did the planning and, and, the, uh, and, the, and the legal drafting uh, and of course the bill had to be amended and has been amended and amended and amended and amended until it's now grown into a large and important project uh, for which I think the people of the United States are deeply thankful one thing I know is it is so firmly embedded in the American psychology today that no politician, no political party, no political group could possibly destroy this act and still maintain our democratic system. It is safe. It is safe forever and for the benefit of the people of the United States. Thank you so much.